Well, here's stage four. Got the double lobe cam and uh, the JB welded up cylinder head and uh, got her all ready to roll here. I'm uh, hoping it's going to be an actual air compressor this time. I was rather disappointed with 12 PSI. Up here and see what she'll do. Oh yeah, look at that. Pushing 30 pounds now. Well, we'll let her fill the tank up then. I got a long spark plug in it there. Threads go right through the cylinder head into the JB weld about a uh, quarter inch. So it gives it more to grip. My engine's smoking a bit today there. I keep tipping it over, putting that big pulley on. Speaking of the pulleys, I'm running a 3 inch on the engine and a 14 inch on the compressor uh, B section belt. Hey, how do you like that? Don't worry, we almost 20 pounds on the gauge. Major improvement from the first three videos. Not really the ideal setup with my air peg mounted right on the compressor there, but yesterday the thing wasn't putting out enough air to fill the air hose up, so that's why I did that. And I wanted to keep things the same, so I left it that way. Uh, she looks to be staying at about 20. Let me check it. Let's check it with the tire gauge here. See if it makes any difference. Well, the tire gauge is reading about 24 pounds. I was kind of expecting a little higher than that, but. Personally, I think it's got to do with the uh, valve timing. The exhaust valve's opening too early, and the intake's opening too early. Anyway, I'll think up some other changes and make another video.